How could you not want to be out here? I mean, look at this. You hear that? Nature. Oh, look at that. Look at that way. I'm taking a little break. Ugh. Oh, no. Who wouldn't want to be out here enjoying all this nature? I mean, it's beautiful. It's quiet. Nobody bothers you. No rules. You know? Only the rules you make. I love it. It's a nice little getaway. Nice. Look out here. Coming from over there. Yeah. This is where it's at. Nature. A little walk out here. Clear your mind. Burn a little fat. Maybe catch a snake. Catch a snake bite. You know, you never know. It's always a, a different adventure when you come out here. Oh, I'll check in later. You're walking along this, the RV, and suddenly you see this. And that signifies coming out this way. So this is back from the RVs to the uh, Florida Trail. Now this part here, this little section is usually dry. As far as I've seen, it's usually dry. <clears throat> but uh, once you get back, which is right here, and here is the Florida Trail, the intersection, and you can go north. There's the blaze. Or you can go south back towards oasis which is where i'm going and this would be flooded as long as i've been coming out here since about last august starting out last august uh this has always been you know flooded but uh, this is nice it's uh it's a different feel to come out here and uh you know, it's still rugged and everything, but uh, I mean, I'm in, I'm flip flops basically. So it's nice. The ORVs are, you know, very gravel, but uh, still, you know, easy to walk on. <clears throat> I'd come, I'd say this is harder to walk on, <laughs> limestone, but um. Yeah, it's uh, it is dry. I mean, you have two different types of trail, basically. I mean, I'm sure if you dig under this mud or this dirt a little bit, you'll start getting a little bit of uh, moisture. But, uh, yeah, it is dry. Now, I wonder if the, the middle section of these 30 miles back to the 75 are dry. That'd be interesting to find out. 
it'd be a hard hike. Those uh, 30 miles took me four days. But that was, of course, under flooded conditions. I wonder, you know, being that it's dry like this, how long it would take the 30 miles. You know, it's interesting. Maybe something to consider. A little summer project, a little summer hike. <clears throat> well, I'll check in a little bit later if I see anything cool. See, I, <clears throat> I refer to these little sections. Like this is a, usually a dry spot of the trail, but then you come to here, this section, and it's uh, what I call a nursery. It's like a little pool, and it's usually about, you know, uh, you know it, uh, it's been knee deep for me at times, but it's uh, completely dry now. And you see all these little crayfish and uh, sometimes these other fish uh, swimming around in there. But yeah, not, not now. It's incredible. <clears throat> 